Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to Bingo Productions. I'm Colin. I've got a big announcement. I may have stated in some past videos I would be working on a graphic novel. That's been the case. I have been working on it. Mostly what's been taking up my time is the script. It's taken me a long time uh, getting the story out there, writing it all down, and then I hired a editor. She's incredibly, incredibly talented, and she's helped me a lot and seen some of the mistakes I make, which is really great, because I want this story to be the best it can be. I've also hired an artist. It's great, I'll put some images up right here. So right here is our main character. His name is Michael Worley. He's based off of Jackson. Um, he's not here right now. He'll be coming home pretty soon, probably about October or September, around there. But um, this is our main character, Michael Worley, based off of Jackson Worley. And so I think it looks awesome. It looks really cool. Um, and the way he's dressed, the reason it looks a little weird is because it's the story of Teal and Eagle, this graphic novel I'm working on, takes place in the future. So about uh, 2040, 2050, 2060, so about 40, 50 years in the future. Um, so that's why he looks that way. And then if we go to the next picture, we have uh, Lieutenant Wolfgang. Um, now he is in some kind of like uh, magic robes with a helmet and a cape and everything and behind him is some soldiers which is really cool so he's the villain and now if we go to the next picture we have them both again Micah and Wolfgang but they have magic so in our story it takes place in modern day in the future but they both have magic um, and so I just think these images are so cool. I just think they look fantastic. My artist, his name is Chris, he is fantastically talented. He, he's doing work I would never be able to do. I, can, I can't even draw like that. So I'm really happy that I found somebody as talented as him. Um, so this is a project that I've always, always wanted to do. I've always wanted to make Teal and Eagle something tangible. I guess something more than what it was, than a YouTube series. I've been back and forth with Jackson emailing him, and he is totally blown away with what the artist has done. He's given me a lot of tips, even though he's not here. Um, but it's just nice to, you know, go back and forth with him. And we have these conversations, these quick emails back and forth. He's given me a lot of advice that really helps when I get overwhelmed with a lot of the stress of creating this graphic novel. This is something I can't not do. If I don't do it, I'm going to regret it, and I'm just going to be miserable with missing this opportunity, missing this chance to get this graphic novel made. So, yeah, um, these pictures are amazing. My artist is fantastic. I got a great writer that's almost done with the script, and then our contract ends, and she has been really helpful. So, um, I'll keep you guys posted. I'll send more as more comes, but... Um, I think this will be a really great story that I think a lot of people will enjoy. So anyway, guys, thanks.